Welcome to Bold Ventures TV, brought to you by Org PR LLC and Seifarth Shaw LLP. Tonight, Gene Creech and guest host Jay Myers interview Craig Cronenberger, CEO of Good Egg Studios, creators of Elf Island. Craig, tell us a little bit more about um, where you see the future of gaming going. What, what, when you when you sit around, you have you have a few moments. What's the vision that you see? Yeah, I, I think that the social aspect of it from a community standpoint, I think, is probably the most critical. I think that uh, what you're seeing with social gaming on Facebook, as an example, uh, demonstrates the importance of it. Uh, if you look at things like Second Life uh, or other virtual world products where there's a lot of chat conversations going on, there's people conducting business within game environments itself, I think above and beyond anything, the social aspect of it has huge impacts of it and people can interact with people on a global basis um, and they can interact in a very unique way whether it's through gameplay or, or through doing business um, and I think that is really ultimately driving um, the evolution of gaming from where it was uh, back in the 80s and, and, and from where it's come it's not about one person sitting down and playing um, a game. It's about mm -hmm. uh, a community of users or multiple users uh, engaging in gameplay together, uh, uh, playing against each other, playing with each other to accomplish the goals. Um, and I think that social aspect becomes pretty pretty important. You know, so do uh, as the social aspects become more important, do the security aspects as there do those become more important Huge. as well? Huge. So, what's yeah. going to happen there? Well, it, it's a very complicated thing because um, it, 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 it's difficult in the sense that um, you can protect um, and create privacy boundaries, but you uh, constantly have people trying to break down the boundaries. Um, and in the kids space, um, there are lots of ways of doing it, whether you're doing can chat, where you, whether you say, okay, this is, these are the only phrases you're allowed you say, to use. Right, yes, I've seen right. that, and, yeah. and that's being used already, yeah. yeah common way, uh, there's chat filters, so that if you try to say uh, profanity, um, or use a profanity, you cannot say those words. And then there's also um, ways where you kind of create your own dictionary. Uh, we use a, something that's called an inclusive dictionary where you can only say what's in our dictionary of words. And if you don't say one of our words, you can't say it. Now, it's a, it's a very huge dictionary. Sure. Um, but it creates protections. Um, and, and that has huge impacts. But all that you could do from a technology standpoint, you cannot get around the need of having a human element as part of it. Um, we've invested heavily in what we call our community management tools where uh, we have moderators, they're around the country, uh, virtually they moderate um, on a consistent basis everything that's going on in the game. Mm -hmm. And they're there to look at not only the chat conversations, but how kids are interacting and what they're doing in order to look for potential issues or problems. And, um, and to give warnings or to boot people if there's a problem. Um, and th that community management tool, um, it also allows us to create triggered events, create profiles if there's issues with people. And I think that that um, becomes more and more important as we grow. And I think as you look across most kids-based games, um, at least the ones that are stating they are for kids, um, you will see community management teams, community management technologies, ways to create uh, protection of privacy and protecting those kids. Um, and, and, and in most cases, it often becomes uh, probably the biggest investment for our company in this space is in that area. Thanks for watching Bold Ventures TV, which is the sister show to Bold Ventures Radio. Both are brought to you by Org PR LLC and the law firm Seifarth Shaw LLP. Each week, Gene Creech interviews interesting entrepreneurs from around the country. Every Wednesday night, you can tune into the live broadcast of Bold Ventures Radio at 1620 a.m. or at www.americaswebradio.com. If you have a guest suggestion, send an email to gene at boldventuresprogram.com.